Well, um, I have been out and about traveling a lot the last month and a half. But um, just recent, you know, recently I went to Engage 2013, and that's just an opportunity for economic developers throughout this very select group of individuals, and we share ideas and talk about what's um, trending in our area and um, ways to overcome different things as it approaches your community, as it um, relates to your community. Um, we were able to talk about our community business and industry partnership and what we've done with our workforce initiative and how we have structured it on different target markets as opposed to just overall a workforce initiative. We took more of a targeted approach and did something different. Um, we went to Area Development Site Consultants Forum. That was in December as well. Um, and there, that we have sponsored that event and we sponsored the networking breaks which allowed Valdosta and Miles County to be mentioned several times with one of these different consultants. Um, this is an opportunity that brings consultants together on different panels. Um, some of the topics that we discussed were um, community development and how is your community approaching um, development for the future, whether it be um, from the community development aspect to economic development or how is your community structuring something to look towards what you're going to need in 2015 and how does that relate in the economic development process. Um, we heard a lot from corporations about how they look, how they determine this, what they're looking at in communities when they're doing site selection and how you can make yourself competitive. Um, we heard why are people moving out of California, the good, the bad, and the ugly, so that was an interesting um, topic of conversation. We're doing very good, by the way, <laughs> in Georgia and in Valdosta. And um, also just the site selection process and how incentives are changing, um, what companies are looking for, um, locations, etc. So it was a very um, good learning experience. Um, a, great, a lot of great information that we can take away from and use in our um, work that we do here. Um, and after that, I had the pleasure of visiting Chicago in zero degree weather, which was exciting for a South Georgia girl, so taxi in and out of buildings. But um, we went, we had a day and a half full of meetings, and we met with five different consultants. And I thought the best way for me to talk about the trip um, is to kind of tell you how we present about Austin Lowndes County and how we tied the regional aspect of it together. Um, the way we get more time with a time with a consultant is to have a regional approach because that adds value to the time that they set aside. So we started off by one talking about the front page about where are we located. We're centrally located between Atlanta and Orlando. We're located in close proximity to Jacksonville, Jacksonville Airport, and we focus a lot on Florida and what Florida can offer about Asta. Um, you know, Atlanta we focus on and we focus on Savannah and Brunswick as well. But we focus on Tallahassee, Jacksonville, their port, their airport, and also Orlando and their airport as well. And then close proximity to beaches and quality of life. We also look at this map and, you know, Megan talked a lot about aerospace and how we made the top 10 list for um, suppliers for Boeing and Airbus. Well, if you look at the map, you have, um, who was over here in Mobile? Airbus. You have Airbus, Savannah, you have Gulfstream, and in Charleston, you now have Boeing. Well, we sit directly on I-10 that allows them to very easily connect over I-10 to 95, and that makes an easy corridor for them to travel back and forth. So naturally, aerospace for the future is a good um, target for us to look in and make some potential investments marketing into. Um, we talked about that. We talked a lot about, you know, we sit on 75, I-10, our distribution and logistics. Um, and then we talked about from a regional perspective, how we all work together in some of the regional projects that we have done together to support our area. For instance, Moody Air Force Base, how we play a role in that, as well as the different regions. So we present that because one thing they're looking at is it's great that you have a region, but do you do anything? So we also, um, talked about promoting um, ourselves and our marketing effort that we do with South Georgia Classic and um, other things that we do together. 
And then we tied that into, you know, we talked about our target markets, and then we talked about looking over here, the communities that may have made investments, especially about Austin Lowndes County in the three industrial parks and how we participate in the Shovel Ready Sites program for Georgia. And that gives us a lot of credibility. In addition to that, we do talk about our incentives and what we do have to offer, not just from Georgia, but from our local levels, which are different for everybody. And then we talk about our workforce and the availability that we have and the fact that we have Valdosta State University here and we have a great technical college and we highlight those attributes too and the services that they offer. Um, and then we just talk to them a little bit about, you know, what are you seeing as trends in the area, in your market, what's looking, what's not looking, who's growing. We talk about that. And then we talk overall, you know, do you know where we are? Are you familiar with us? And the majority of them are. You know, it's, it, it's, it's good to see they're familiar with us. We have a great reputation. They know that we are proactive in uh, marketing ourselves and an aggressive community and responsive community. So we have a very nice reputation on there, so which is very good. Um, so we'll just, for follow-up, we'll continue to follow up with these site consultants and keep them up to date on what we're doing here in our community. That concludes my report. We have some other stuff we're doing, so I guess I'll go back. Um, I you know, know there's a one, one of the things that I've always thought about is, is when you talk international and talk region and things like that, we, we need to continue, I think, to promote an international production to the land of the Because if you think about it, and I've I brought this up several times, I brought it up when I was on the commission and, and all this, and we don't do enough of that. But I, we need to keep the airport authority involved in it. But if you think from, from our travel and all that stuff, if we had two international airport connections in the Valdosta Georgia, Lance County, I, it's, it's unbelievable the opportunities that we can generate from the international support standpoint. But, and I think it's just great if, if, if what you've done is good, but you know, because you get an opportunity to expand that. Uh, because I mean, it's, it's just a great opportunity because it's about an hour's flight to Orlando, an hour's flight to Atlanta. You don't have to go through it around it, you can get out, you know, and, and it's, just, it's just a great opportunity, and I don't think we do enough talking and thinking and planning. Okay. Okay. Do you want to say something? Um, um, I think we've talked about the digital plan that the SGRC is doing, um, and we're part, we'll participate in that plan, and we have been invited, so we'll um, participate and plan on that. We also have a legislative luncheon that we'll be hosting with our legislators prior to the session to talk about what we've been doing and what we're interested in watching throughout the session. Um, and that's what we're on. Thank you very much.